Stalagmite 17. The most escape-proof prison in all of Slug Terra. Watchful guards. I take locks, steel doors. And now, in control of it all, me, Mr. Saturday. <laughs> I can think of no better place to hold the world-famous Shane Gang. Go ahead and gloat, Saturday. But you're missing two little things. Oh, and they are? The two of us you didn't manage to capture. And they're probably on their way to rescue us right now. Nothing can keep the great Fronto away from the fight! Hey! Where did everybody go? Oh! Captured! Well, never fear! Fronto will come to the rescue! This is really gonna take a miracle, isn't it? No! it if I wasn't seeing it with my own eyes. The Shane Gang, locked up like a pack of stray dogs. I'll be there before nightfall to collect them. Congratulations, Saturday. You're now officially another minion of Dr. Black. No, 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 no. I am a businessman, and this is strictly business. Although I am running a little low on ghouls, Dr. Black. Call our arrangement what you wish. You'll get, get your, your ghouls, ghouls when I get the Shane Gang. And one other thing, none of your mind control foolishness. I want our prisoners fully aware as they count down the minutes to my arrival. He's not here yet, Saturday. And there's still plenty of time for us to break out. From Stalagmite 17, I have every guard under my control. And they have one simple order to ensure you do not escape. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to get myself a smoothie. I can't believe I got us into this mess. Come on, Eli, it's not your fault. Well, technically it is your fault, but we forgive you. Just don't ask me to forgive myself for what happened. <sighs> Worst surprise party! Gotta use the double barrel blaster! Without the Enigma slug? I've been practicing. But I think I got this. begins with finding out exactly where our friends have been taken to. Mm. Luckily, the Rusty Buckle Cantina is nearby. A watering hole for ex-cons and all species of slack tear and scum. Mm. With Pronto's natural gift of gab, he will easily learn through the criminal underground where our friends may be. This way! <laughs> and now that way! Hurry up, you guys. He'll be back soon. 
Come on, push! <laughs> What's this thing? <laughs> An escape attempt! That is a zombifying offense! Wait, stop! Do you really want to disobey Dr. Black? Mm, I suppose that would be bad for business. But no more escaping! Face it, there's no way out of here except the front door. Don't worry, we still have Pronto and Burpee. Yeah. We must blend in and find a lowlife who just may know where our friends are. <laughs> who do you think you are? Slugs have no place on Mighty Pronto's exquisite shoulder. This a mud shake? Now that's more like it. Leave this to me. Smooth. Hey. <laughs> Such ugly faces must have their ear to the ground. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> Nothing worse than a sassy slug. So, tell me, what news have you heard about the Shane Gang from your brothers in crime? You can tell me. I am an ex-con too, you know. Ex-con? We're the South Cavern Women's Knitting Club! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Settle down. Outnumbered and outneedled, but not outstinked. <laughs> ah, not so tough after a little whiff of flatulerinkus, eh? Actually, smells better than this place did before. <laughs> well, excuse you, Mr. Stripey Shirt. Don't shoot! I just don't want to go back to Stalagmite 17, okay? Ever since that maniac Mr. Saturday took over the place, it's worse than ever. Stalagmite 17? Of course! Not even that impenetrable prison can hold me back. I will climb every wall, break the locks, and evade every last bitey shark! Or you could just use the front door. Ah, the front door, you say? So crazy? It just might work! Good day to you, fine sir! Ah, you see? Exactly as Pronto planned! <laughs> yeah -ha! We're running out of time. Black's gonna be here any minute. It's called a smoothie, not a lumpy. What does it take to get a proper blended fruity drink around here? New escape plan. You know what I miss most in here? Making smoothies back at the hideout. Uh, oh, uh -huh. yes, yes, that's Your smoothies uh, are yummy. You, uh, you like to do. So, you make smoothies? To 
find this elusive front door. <laughs> oh, go ahead and laugh. You slugs cannot understand Pronto's scientific method. <laughs> Hey, what's on your... <sighs> exactly as Proto planned it. <laughs> this is where Proto's natural tracking skills will shine. Ha! I am already on the scent of our captured colleagues. Getting warmer. Even warmer. I am very warm now. Okay, well, in my defense, it is quite warm in here. I am a zombie, eh? Maximum security wing to kitchen. Ah, it's them! Zombies, bring me all the fruit you've got! And a blender! <laughs> that zombie waiter will lead us right to our friends! <laughs> You're dreaming, Saturday. No way I'm making you one of my world-famous, supremely delicious smoothies. Yes, you will, or... Or what? How are you gonna make me, Saturday? I'm not one of your zombie minions. Yet. Cool down, Saturday. Remember what Dr. Black said about no zombieing? It is better to beg for forgiveness than to go another minute without my smoothie! Now! Incoming! And outgoing! <laughs> Glad to have you guys back. Sorry to interrupt the reunion, but Black's gonna be walking down that hallway any second now. Night night, Mr. Saturday. I know. Proto is an expert zombie walker, no? Maximum security. Pronto is here to rescue Eli Shane. That do gooder was the one who put me in here. Exactly as Pronto planned. <laughs> Lucky break. Let's go. <laughs> Or we could take the elevator to glory! Uh, sorry, no room, next car! To glory! Hey, 
I know that smell. Eli Cord and Trixie are this way. Pronto is coming! Try to grab the glory, eh? Everybody can see Pronto is responsible for this. <laughs> you have my heartfelt thanks. Zombie guards to the front gates. Stop the chain gang. <gasps> I'll handle their soon-to-be zombified comrade. Myself. Huh. Front door's open. Our luck continues. <laughs> yeah, not so much. <laughs> Your friends might have escaped, if not for you. So, in return, Mr. Saturday offers you a last word. Actually, Pronto must admit, Pronto is superior to slugs. But maybe not as superior to one slug huh? as he thought. I said last word. Uh, excuse me! I'm not finished, sir! Pronto should have had more faith in you. Huh? Pronto should have let you guide him more. A good team, you and I. You can run, Mr. Saturday, but you cannot hide from the justice of Pronto and Burpee. Careful choosing your slugs. Not the guards' fault, they're zombies. Don't want to hurt them. Possible when Proto is around. Perfect timing. Let's get as far from here as we can. Unfortunately, I don't think you'll be getting very far at all. <laughs> Swim for it! Maybe we can be shark floss. No choice. Gotta slug it out. I do not think so, Dr. Black. Pronto? <laughs> you may laugh at Pronto, but let me introduce you to my little friend. Consider yourselves 
rescued! That flame spire's gonna fizzle! We gotta bail! Question is, how? <laughs> Got it! The double barrel? Eli, what if it doesn't work? Burpee thinks it will. <laughs> you had seen what I have, my friends. You would not hesitate to have faith in this slot. <laughs> That's good enough for me. Too, Pronto. Yes, we made a great team. Did Pronto just share credit with a slug? Of course, because Pronto knows how to handle slugs. You see, all of you could take a lesson from Pronto. Be strict, but fair, with a steady hand. In order to understand a slug, you must go to a simple 20 point checklist. Step number one does it stink? And by stink, I mean smell. Pronto! Okay, what part of Proto must never go home to Mole Mount did you not understand? <laughs> Mole up, Pronto. We have more urgent matters to attend to. <laughs> <laughs> These people don't move. Someone's gonna get hurt. Molinoids of Mole Mount, for your safety, please take yeah, cover yeah. and leave El Diablo's Nacho to the Shane Gang. <laughs> Why aren't the Molinoids concerned for their safety? Pronto is not like other Molinoids. They see what they want to see. And there's only one of us in danger here. Me! You can't outrun your past, Pronto. <laughs> But whatever you did here couldn't have been that bad. It's a king! Hail, King Pronto! Pronto is their king? <laughs> Pronto's their king? No wonder he refers to himself in the third person. And has delusions of grandeur. Uh, guys? <laughs> Did the underground say why Black sent Nacho to Mole Mound? Nope. What are Molinoids known for? Weak eyes. Blocked pores. Largest collection of maps in Slug Terra. Pasty complexions? Oh wait, that last one! <laughs> <laughs> Score another win for the Shane Gang. Huh? Nacho's gone. But he was kicking our butts. Why'd he run? Because he's smart enough to know he wouldn't get another lucky shot in. Uh oh. <laughs> uh, oh, thank you. Uh, uh, he'll be impossible to live with now. Uh, at least His Majesty doesn't refer to himself with the royal we. Don't give him any ideas. Surely you jazz. Probably would never put on airs. As heir to the Mole Mound throne, you must take it. Huh? Hmm. Guys, Nacho left a trail we could follow all the way across Slug Terra. But that is not the way out of Mole Mound. That is the path to wisdom, which leads to the Vault of Knowledge. Ugh. 
the repository of all Molinoid information, including the Mappe Mundi, the famed Molinoid map of everything. Everything? Every cavern, tunnel, bridge, shortcut, and hidey hole in Slag Terra. That's gotta be what Dr. Black sent Nacho here to find. If I'm right about Black being in league with the Dark Bane, that map could give him other routes to the deep caverns. We can't allow that. A lucky thing King Pronto could order his whole army after Nacho. No, the Molinoid King does not command armies. He serves his people paw and foot 25-7. Eight years backlog and those toilets ain't gonna plant themselves. <laughs> <laughs> Pronto is not amused. Listen, not to worry, folks. The Shane Gang will take on Nacho and save your Mape Mundi. <laughs> Pronto, you can sort this king stuff out later. But Nacho has a big head start and we need to move. That life is over now, your highness. Now that you have finally returned to us, you must face up to your obligations. Oh, well, there you go. That's it, you see. I'm booked solid. Wall-to-wall -wall adventures right through the middle of the next decade. So, here you go. There's that. And if I'm gonna find Nacho and save your map, I need my talented tracker. Yes. <laughs> Sire, you may draw your friends a map to the map. <sighs> here, in this cavern that is under an attack. We are here, it is there. We're playing catch up. Ignorance is bliss. Molinoid motto. Well, our bliss requires Black's ignorance. After you. This can't be right. Well, he did just scribble that thing together in three seconds. Seriously? If this is the path to wisdom, no wonder the Molinoids prefer ignorance. We could have really used Pronto to get through this maze. Sorry, but today is Random Complaints Day. Come back tomorrow for wardrobe malfunctions. <sighs> is this Pronto's destiny to spend my days ruling over the most boring matters in all of Slug Terra? And your evenings repairing everything that needs fixing around here. Oh, I don't want to be king! You will not have to worry about that for long. <clears throat> Point of order, Your Honor. I beg the court's indulgence to plead for my, uh, not guiltiness. It was a simple misunderstanding, really. <laughs> Spitting on the sidewalk is illegal in this town. Judge Logan has us enforce the law with no exceptions. It's just God! In conclusion, I throw myself on the mercy of the court. Oh, please, Your Honor. Pretty, 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 please, with the uh, 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 chocolate sauce on it. Guilty. <laughs> well, he did actually do it. So let's just pay the fine and get out of here. Fifty years, hard labor. <laughs> Fifty years? <laughs> oh, it's all my fault. I had to do something to stop him from stealing my gum. I thought it would teach him a lesson. Your Honor, you can't be serious. Fifty years for spitting on the sidewalk? Look, I'm Eli Shane, and I want to see justice done, too. But this is... A Shane, huh? Never much cared for the Shanes. But in your case, I'll make an exception. And not put you away for aggravated sass! Lock him up! Wait! This is a travesty of justice! I've got my eye on you. Oh! Trixie, Cord, we need to poke around this jail and see what it's made of. Why? Because we're gonna bust Pronto out.
Ah, locked up like a common criminal. This is an outrage. There is nothing common about Pronto. What are you then? Some kind of criminal mastermind? Hmm? Uh, why yes, uh, yes indeed. I am the head of a vast organization, infamous for its villainy and sharp attire. I thought you were pinched for spitting gum. Uh, true, but that was the least of my crimes. Uh, what are you in for? Public speaking. He's in for breathing too loud, and they locked him up for aggravated smiling. Yeah, that Judge Logan has a real racket going. He, he locks you up for breaking ridiculous laws and then sells you off for hard labor. And not just any hard labor. I hear they send you to work for Dr. Black. <gasps> Dr. Black? That's what my source tells me. <laughs> Judge Logan clears out his jails and Black gets free workers for his smelters. Well, how long do we have? Few days, maybe? Then we need to move fast. Now let's go over the plan. This delivers supplies to the jail every day. Paid the driver to take his place. If we pull this off, we'll cut away everyone undetected. Good. Remember, guys, Pronto isn't the only one in there who's been unjustly locked up. There are other prisoners in there that need our help. Then we can put a stop to that judge. Now, tell me about the shot I've got to make. It's pretty close to impossible, so I get you this. Pretty awesome. Yeah, that SVX 5000 scope gives you every angle, every reading, every trajectory to make amazing shots. And I mail ordered this speed stinger slug to go with the scope. He's the only slug that can make it work, because all the scope's data and angles are put right into his little high-tech goggles. Hi, Stunts. Welcome to the team. Now, let's go over the plan. First, Cord will drive up to the jail and act casual, like he's delivering supplies. Trixie will make sure the guard is distracted and give me the sign. Then it's all up to me and the speed stinger. And if everything goes according to plan, we hit velocity, ricochet off the wagon, rebound off the flagpole, make its way to the cooling tower, make a series of bank shots to the jail roof. Go in through the air vent, make a bank shot, a quick roll, spring the lock, into the cage, open the cuff, and with the coast clear, get everyone to safety without anyone being the wiser. Okay, guys, let's go spring pronto. Just trust the high-tech stuff, right? This is a little confusing. I hope you're getting all this stunts. Oh no. Oh man. Oh. Not good. That was a complete and total disaster. What did we tell you, Eli? The one weak spot in your plan is that nobody can make that shot. Yeah, nobody. Well, except maybe Mario Bravado. Mario who? What? Oh, come on. Mario Bravado? Only the greatest trick shot slinger ever. Here, check it out. He could make any shot. Yeah, had his own show and everything. What happened to him? Apparently he dropped out of the spotlight and now owns a restaurant out in the middle of nowhere. Well, I think it's time Mario Bravado made a comeback, and fast. This can't be the right place. Why would a trickshot legend live here? Hey, welcome to Ricochet Pizza. We sling the best pies at Slug Terra. What can I get you? Are you Mario Bravado? No, I'm Mario the pizza guy. Look, I think I know who you are, and I've been told that only Mario Bravado can make the trick shot I need. Sorry, that Mario's retired. The only things I sling now are pizza pies. So if you want to keep talking, order something. See, a friend of mine has... Uh, uh, uh. No pizza, no talking. 
Oh, okay. I'll have the Super Slinger Super Cheese. <laughs> Order up! One Super Super Cheese! All right, let me tell you about the shot I need from you. See, a friend of mine, I already told you, I'm retired. I'll never, ever, ever fire a slug again. This is a matter of life and death. Judge Logan has been selling prisoners to Dr. Black and... What you really need help with is your hearing. I said no! That went well. So I'm surrounded by fire scorpions, but they realize I am the toughest molenoid they've ever seen. Then what happened? <laughs> One simple nod, and the entire pack scurries away in fear. That's why my organization will bust me out of here. You see, it's about fear and the respect. Kind of a fearful respect. The Molinoid is trouble. Especially with a shame in his corner. Sooner we have them out of here, the better. See what you can do. <sighs> Listen, I... I said no! Now scram! I'm just here to, uh, eat. Uh, uh, can't believe I ate that much pizza. Look, my friend is in real trouble. This isn't for me, it's for him. They tell me you're the only one who can make the shot I need. That's all? Sounds like more trouble than it's worth, kid. Forget it. I'm done slinging. Forever. What happened to you? Excuse me? You were some big hero, then you just disappeared. Uh, I'm no hero. I was a kid with a TV show, that's all. I know a little bit about being famous, you know. My dad was Will Shane. What? Really? Well, you could have mentioned that. Would it have changed your mind? Nope. All right, then. Sorry I wasted your time. And mine. Wait, I'm not gonna take the shot. But if it's that important, I'll teach you how to do it. Should be no problem for a Shane. I hope you're a good teacher, because I don't have a lot of time. Okay, that's three large, no onion. Thanks for calling ricochets. Okay, remember, 90% of trick shooting is half mental. So first things first, we make the pizza. Uh, what? Uh, if it helps my friend, I'll try anything. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Uh, making pizza? Relax, we'll get to that. First things first, figure out the order, the layers. Plan it out in your head. Can you guess what I'm looking at right now? The ingredients. Uh, wrong. I'm looking at the finished pizza in my head. When you start something, always know what it is you're wanting to finish. In this case, we're making what? Three large pizzas, the works. It's about lining up all the ingredients together. You wanna see why this place is called Ricochet Pizza? They said no onion. Good, you're paying attention. Now make three large pizzas, the works. No onion. We need to make the whole pizza in one shot. Ricochet pizza, remember? Right. that again. High-tech stuff just doesn't get it done like finely honed instincts. You got them. You just have to trust them. Okay, 
So now do we do some slinging? If you mean slinging more pizzas, yes. Okay, hit this with pepperoni without looking. How was that? Uh, I think you need a little more honing. You're improving, Eli, but you gotta relax. Okay, when do I learn to shoot? That's what you've been doing. You just don't know it yet. You've got a trick shooter's heart, Eli, and I've never seen anyone so connected with their slugs, other than me. So why did you quit? I haven't told anyone this, you know. I was at the top of my game. Felt like nothing could go wrong. I guess I was a little too cocky. One day I was offered a job, and I refused. Probably said a few things I shouldn't have. I got called out. If I lost, I'd have to quit forever. I thought I couldn't be beat. I was wrong. I got hit by a slug I had never seen before. Never want to see it again. It was a ghoul, wasn't it? You dueled black. Doesn't matter. I'm a man of my word, and I told you I'd train you. So, have you and Stunts figured it out? And even though you forgot to add extra cheese, I think you're ready. You know Dr. Black is a cheat. He'd never hold up his end of the bargain. You don't owe him anything. This world needs you. So do I. Okay, we're in. Really? Great. But you're making the shot. Good news! I got trained up, and I brought Mario Bravado to back me up. Hey, yeah, hey, look at you. Wow, you're really Mario Bravado. Do you remember the episode of your show, number 56, where you shot that slug right... Lord, we don't have time for this. Nice to meet you, Mario. Love the jacket. We got some bad news, Eli. They're leaving. Now. <sighs> For a trick shot to break him out of jail. You can do it, kid. Put all your ingredients together. It's just as easy as making a pizza. What have they been doing? Guys, we need to get a move on. It's been a while, hasn't it, friend? You're gonna sling? You're not afraid of black. I don't have to be either. It's time to come out of retirement. But you're still making the shot. Right. Cord, catch that train. <laughs> Gang? Step on it! There they are! Ha -ha! They've come for me! Hey, who's that other guy? Hey, this Bob Pronto's the real deal! He's got Mario Bravado in his gang! Well, of course! I taught Mario Bravado everything he knows! Mario who? Hey, Eli! We got trouble up ahead! Once the express goes in that tunnel, we won't be able to follow. It'll be too late. Talk about a trick shot. Take out the guards, free Pronto, and try to stay on this wagon. Gord, you focus on driving. Trixie, we'll need you as a spotter. <laughs> Don't get cocky, kid. That tunnel's getting closer fast! <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, I think they just picked up speed. I got four more guards and we still have to get the prisoners loose. Here we go, kid. Sling it like you mean it. Said it, kid. Mm. All this talk of pizza has given Proto a powerful hunger for the extra cheese. Ah, oh, it was hard on the inside, let me tell you. And the food pff, was atrocious. Pronto, you were barely in jail two days. And yet, I survived. You can still make the best trick shots. If you're ever ready to make a comeback for real, you've got a spot on our team. Thanks. But I think I'll stick to slinging pizzas, for now. But someday, hey, who knows? <laughs> it's great we got Pronto out, but what are we gonna do about Judge Logan? Give him a taste of his own medicine. illegal in these parts. No, wait. I was praying. That gum was awful, like hot sauce and rotten fish. We enforce the law with no exceptions. Your orders, sir. What? Wait! Hold on! This is ridiculous! No trace of Nacho. Must be pretty far ahead. We need to pick up the pace. How's Nacho nowhere to go? We have Pronto's map. What does Nacho have? Ask him! I thought we were goners. Must be dumb luck we got away. Uh... Any guesses? Maps always have a riddle or a cleverly hidden clue to point the way in cases like this. 
Now let me see. How would Pronto think? Found it! <gasps> It says 100 right on the pack, but I only count 98. Yeah, well, once I got 92. Grab me a river. Max! My co-worker looked at me funny. There! there she's doing it again! <sighs> I now pronounce your man and wife. Max! My faucet's been dripping for the last 2,927 days, and you have to fix it, Your Majesty. Six on the dot, don't be late. And don't track in dirt like the last king. Which reminds me, bring a mop. What is wrong with us? Don't we Moronoids know how to do anything? My liege, they are not used to thinking for themselves. That's always been the king's job. Ignorance is bliss, right? <laughs> but I don't have to tell you that. Unless you think I should. I mean, you are the king. What do you think I should do? We're supposed to keep climbing. Yeah, well, we ain't climbing that. You're right. We're gonna have to float up. <laughs> It's Nacho! <laughs> <laughs> Nacho's going the wrong way! Maybe he knows a shortcut? Yeah, maybe we should follow Nacho. No. <laughs> Sealed. We're here first. Huh. I was expecting it to be, uh, you know, grander. Now how do we get in? The doors are covered in smolten. Remember this guy? Your forge smelter. Perfect! <laughs> Well, dig in. <sighs> you see, she says potato, and I say potato. That's it! I'm cutting this whole thing off! I quit! But Majesty, the law is very clear. His Majesty can quit, but first he must find a volunteer to take his place. Oh, but... No one is foolish enough to volunteer for this! If it is foolish to desire a life of service to one's people, call me a fool. But I volunteer! Zido! My life! Lord! Nemosis! It is my honor to pick up the Mole King mantle and hereby lay claim to the kingship. I quit! And you are? You know full well that I am Pronto, the mole who humiliated you in the slag run. Humiliated? This does not ring a bell. <laughs> oh, okay. Maybe this would clear the wax from your ears. Pronto, former heir to the Mole Mound throne, and now your king. Ah, yes. You wear the crown of the king. A little big for you, no? We think perhaps it would fit us better. The royal we? No! How dare you presume to be like Pronto? We, uh, uh us! Then we challenge you for the kingdom. <gasps> he can do that? <laughs> it is all very legal, I assure you. Indeed, the challenge must be met, or Sido, unopposed, shall become our new king. Yeah. Then, His Highness accepts your challenge. Slaps at five paces. And may the best mole win. Not if Pronto has his way. His Majesty was challenged, and so has first pick. You knew 
I would go for the shiny one. So perhaps this is what you wish me to do. Therefore, I should choose the other. But you are a crafty opponent. And you know Proto is smart and would think many moves ahead. <laughs> and so you must really want me to choose the shiny one. How do you? You think you can outwit your king by making him doubt himself. But it is I who have outwitted you, my wily nemesis. You choose first. Don't ask me why, but I honestly thought you'd go for the other one. Five paces. Turn and duel. One, two, three, four, five. Huh? <laughs> hmm. Find something? Not the map. Something else. Can we hurry up before Nacho realizes his mistake? He's already here. Thanks for leading the way. Us? You were a step ahead the whole time. No, he wasn't. He tailed us. It was an elaborate fake out, and we fell for it. Now, hand over the map. Don't have it. But if you want to help us search, we could use the extra hands. I prefer to work alone. Guys, grab onto something! <laughs> Yo, -ho! King, watch your face. Come out and face me like a mole. Oh, get in! Ah! Ha! I shall smite you with my kingly might. <laughs> That's it! What's it? does not know the meaning of the word. Then as king, I shall work to improve the schools. Hand it over. What does Black want with it? This slug has caused me a lot of trouble. Hand me the map, or it's paste. <laughs> Stop! Take it. But whatever Black has planned, he won't get away with it. Eli, don't! Sorry, Trix. It's the only way. <laughs> Buzzsaw, help them out. Guys, this place is coming down. <laughs> <laughs> You would not blast an unarmed Say my name or spare the consequences. Your name, little mole, is Toast. <laughs> you remind me of someone. A nosy little mole whose interference put me in the red with black. Uh, yes, and that was me! Hmm, I think not. 
A mole that stands in my way would be much more imposing. <laughs> That's it! I quit! But of course you do. So, the sum total of Molinoid history. Yeah, that can't be good. Plus, Nacho got the map. Actually, he's not the only one who knows how to pull a bait and switch. <laughs> uh, confidentially, I hope your friends beat Nacho to the map of Mundi. Then it will be my pleasure and not that brutish fellow's to hand the map over to Dr. Black. Dr. Black? Yes. My benefactor has given me a second chance to be his second chance. And with Dr. Black's backing, this king won't be clearing drains and settling petty squabbles for the little moles. Dark person! I and Quinn! Ah. No take backs. Aha! But I had my fingers crossed when I said I quit. Ah, it does not count. Ah. The finger cross, double cross. Curse that Molinoid rule. <laughs> he attacked our royal personage. Justice demands that we whack this mole. What? The royal we? <laughs> Folks, really sorry, but your people's history is... History. Oh, no. Ah, yes! A somewhat indirect smiting, Your Majesty. Yes, another senseless victim of second-hand smote. Oh, no. Eli? The map Mundi, Your Majesty. It holds dangerous secrets. I urge you to destroy it, so Dr. Black can never come after it again. You want me to eliminate the last surviving fragment of Molinoid history? Can I do that? Actually, you can. The missing chapter of the Book of Mole Mound. It's been lost for ages. Eh, what the hey? Ignorance is bliss, right? Burpee? So, uh, what does the new chapter say about the king going on adventures with his friends, maybe? It says that if the king is absent or unable to perform his duties as required, he must appoint a proxy. Aha! Then I dub thee Sido, keeper of the keys, <laughs> royal stopper of leaks, and decider of all things squabbly and petty. Of course, questions of Mormont policy will remain with the king. Me. You... 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 Majesty will do. Although I would have accepted my liege and or your highness. Nacho really played us. Too predictable. So we'll change up our game. That's not what bothers me. The Mape Mundi didn't just point the way to the deep caverns. It marked the location of the drop. What if Black doesn't want to go deeper? What if he's searching for a way to the surface? Yeah, but since the one and only copy of the map is Toast, Black's not going anywhere, right? Hey, if you destroyed the original map, what does Nacho have? <sighs> hmm. 